the stores are open, so it definitely sends the message that you can do it. This is what December 24th looks like in Montreal as shoppers get busy buying their last minute Christmas gifts. As of December 25th, all non-essential businesses in Quebec must close until January 11. That means no traditional Boxing Day. My father owns uh, the, the brand uh, since more than 40 years, Basha. And uh, I can tell you one thing that there's nothing. I'm down 80%. Even the stores are really down here in downtown. Quebec has seen six straight days of over 2,000 cases daily, breaking another record today with 2,349 cases and 46 additional deaths. Hospitalizations and ICU numbers continue to climb and many warn things will only get worse. But some say as long as people are practicing safe distancing and wearing their masks, finishing up their Christmas shopping is safe. As long as they respect the rules, like when it comes to to um, the mask, the face covering, and um, basically um, disinfecting your hands, the hand washing. Um, a lot of people have bad habits of putting their hands in their hair, around their face. You have to learn, of course, not to do that. And the, dist um, the distance, keeping a safe distance also, I think that um, it, it, it's perfectly safe. Quebec saying that anyone who breaks COVID-19 rules will face tickets of 1000 to $6,000. And Montreal Mayor Valérie Plante saying residents should call the police if they see anyone not adhering to public health measures. But will Montrealers call the cops on their neighbours? I don't want to be locked down longer than we have to because people are careless. So 100%. I would 100% call the cops. Of course not. It's not of my business. Everybody's mature enough to know what they're doing. We're social beings, so of course we're going to be seeking company, especially for, for Christmas. The holidays is about family. We have WhatsApp, we have so many different methods of contacting our family members and friends. So I encourage people to use them. It's actually less crowded than I would have expected. Then again, it is still early in the day. So we'll see how, how the day unfolds. In Montreal, Samsara Rainville, City News.